Hi everyone, fly over here and welcome to another tutorial video. This is gonna be very short tutorial, but actually I decided to record this video because I saw on Facebook uh, in MSFS page actually many people asking uh, about same things. So I was thinking like why not make a video and then maybe people will see and it's gonna be helpful to somebody. So. I actually already prepared the flight and then I remember okay now the crucial thing in every uh, flight is and actually what people don't know is how to set up performance page assuming that you already make your flight plan in Simbrief and you already import and uh, enter your departure arrival and everything whatever you need so now you are at performance page and you need to enter this data but you don't know what to enter okay i mean if you enter flaps one uh, airbus will automatically calculate fly by wire will automatically calculate v1 vr and v2 speeds for you but then you can take off only with uh, full power and you cannot use flex but what if you want to use the flex how okay easy Okay, let's first calculate the trim. That one is super easy. So there is a page on forum and I will leave you the link down in the description. You will go to this link and you will download this file. You don't need to have uh, you don't need to be to sign up or something. You just download this file and after you download that file, you will have a uh, zip file like this and you just extract to your uh, hard disk and uh, you will have inside uh, exe file and also text file so you open just that exe file and uh, you will have like this your trim calculator and now uh, what we need is actually to see what is our center of gravity and our center of gravity we can see here in init page on second page and here we see that our center of gravity is 24 decimal 3 so 24 decimal 3 and then just press calculate and it tell us that we need to set up our trim 9 degrees up so how are we gonna do it 9 0.9 up okay so we're going to performance page and we're gonna enter flaps so one dash 0 0.9 up and just press here and that is your trim okay this is your trim now how to set up that trim easy uh, if you look here on this middle display you press fctl so you can see this page and here you have pitch trim and then when you come to the wheel it will show you are you up or down okay so we need to be 0 0.9 up so we just go until 0 0.9 up and that is your trim completely set super easy like i said okay for flex to temp is a little bit different so uh, we will also go to the link in the description of the video and uh, we need to fill this for so we have our aircraft at the moment it's only working with airbus a320 so we are at uh, lima oscar whiskey kilo okay and we will take off from runaway 20 Eight right runaway is dry but actually it's not it's wet because uh, it's snow outside uh, what else we need to fill in is outside temperature how are we gonna see outside temperature easy this one so we are going to uh, look at our uh, tablet here and if you import flying from Simbrief you can see matter here meteorological report you can have with icons and you can have textual meteorological report so we know that outside temperature is one degrees so what we're gonna do we're gonna just enter here one degrees 
Next, we need take of weight. How we gonna find take of weight? Also easy. We going to our operational flight plan, and here we have a take of weight of sixty nine seven sixty. The sixty nine seven sixty, and we gonna enter that too. Sixty nine seven sixty. Okay. Pax is on, air conditioned right, and we are gonna take off with flaps 1, and now you just press calculate, and it's going to tell you, okay, you have wind here, you have uh, that much and that much uh, runaway available, and also it will calculate your uh, speed, and also it will calculate your flex temperature. So our flex temperature is 43, what we are gonna do now is just go to your MCU and you're gonna key in 43 flex to temperature and also you can key in those speeds so it was 128 it was 139 and it was 142 and you're done super easy I'm gonna leave you both links down in the description and I hope it was clear. If you have any question, of course, you can always ask me down in the comments. I will be happy to help you. And thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video.